Hello everyone and welcome back to another episode of Police Simulator Patrol Officers. I do hope you're having a great day of course. Happy Monday or whenever you are watching this. And for this week's episodes we are going to be using this New Hampshire State Police Pack. Which is actually quite ironic as I actually live in the UK county of Hampshire. So uh, yeah I saw this and I thought we'd have a go at it. Now I did try in the past and actually um, the name tags were broken. And they sort of uh, conflicted with the one I have. But as you can see I managed to rectify that by going into the files. And effectively uh, taking out the names that the mod author had put in there. So everything else is as the mod creator made it. I've just removed the name so I can use my name. Anywho, with that all being said, let's get into it, shall we? And as is usual, if you want to use any of the mods showcased in this week's videos, they will be down in the description. And I thought for a change, we're actually going to go back to sticking in a certain district because as you can see, we only have 19 out of 30 duty stars. Yes, we have unlocked everything, but I thought, why not try and get a couple of stars and then we'll get Brixton done because we have five out of ten so we actually need five and then we can go back to the other districts and get the remaining stars from there so with that being said we're going to go for a 45 minute shift and 119 you can show me 10 41 10 8 And I think for today's episode, we are going to take the Dodge Charger. And some of the eager wide viewers among you may realize that this isn't the correct siren that they actually use in New Hampshire. I couldn't find the one that they actually use, but this one's going to be as close as I could possibly get. And 119, you can show me 1097 code 3 to that robbery call. Oh my god, sir, are you serious? Man, literally just run out in front of me. Anywho, 119, I'm gonna be 23 on scene. Okay, evening, ma'am. Captain Martin, Brighton Police Department, would you mind telling me what happened here, what you saw? Okay, ma'am, thank you very much for that. Do you have any idea on you at all? Thank you very much, much appreciated. Okay, what have we got here? Hazel Ellis, that is going to be valid. And that is also going to be clear and valid. Wonderful, ma'am. You are going to be free to leave. You have a great evening. Take care. Evening, ma'am. Captain Martin, Brighton Police Department. Would you mind telling me what happened here, what you saw? Okay, ma'am. Thank you very much for that. Do you have any idea on you at all? Thank you very much. Okay, Min Xia Tian, that is going to be valid. And that is going to be clear and valid. And negative dispatch, I am currently 10-6. Alright ma'am, you are going to be free to leave. You have a wonderful evening, take care. Excuse me sir, can you put the phone down for me please? Captain Martin, Brighton Police Department, would you mind telling me what happened here, what you saw? Okay, sir. Thank you very much for that. Any idea on you at all? Thank you very much. 
Okay, we have Reynaldo Lombardi. That is going to be valid. And that is going to be clear and valid. No registration, no insurance, but he wasn't driving, so that is all good. Okay, sir, I just had a quick whiff of cannabis there. Have you got anything on you that you shouldn't have? Just going to give you a quick frisk. Okay, right, you're all good. All right, sir, thank you for your cooperation. You have a great evening. Take care. Excuse me, sir. Have word for you, please. Captain Martin, Brighton Police Department. Reason for the detainment as you match the description of a wanted person. Okay, sir, any idea on you at all? Thank you very much. Okay, any Utopia? Okay, sir. At this time, you're going to be placed under arrest for robbery. Please turn around and place your hands behind your back for me. 119, one in custody. Okay, so anything on you is going to poke me, hurt me, stick me, or otherwise. Okay, switch blades, stolen a handbag, napkins, and a nail clipper. All right, sir. Just mind your head for me. Okay. Right. Let's get a nice thumbnail here. Oh, that one looks good. There we are. That'll do. 119, that robbery call is going to be code 4, and you can show me 1, 10, 15, 10, 19. Okay, sir, I'm on your head, please. Okay, sir, step in here for me and I will take those cuffs off. One nineteen, you can show me code four and ten eight available for calls. One nineteen, I'll be ten ninety seven code three to that aggravated assault call. Seriously, the flip. Just run out in front of me, why don't you? Come on, people, out of the way, please.
119, I'm 23 on scene. Sir, can you hear me? Just stay with me, alright? I'm gonna have an ambulance en route for you. 119, I need a 1052 down to my current 20. I have multiple injured pedestrians here. Excuse me, sir. Can you put the phone down for me, please? Captain Martin, Brighton Police Department. Would you mind telling me what happened here, what you saw? Okay, sir. Thank you very much for that. Do you have any ID on you at all? Thank you, sir. Okay, Alessandro Costa, that is going to be valid. And that is going to be clear and valid. No insurance, but he wasn't driving, so that is going to be all good. Okay, sir, thank you very much for that. You are free to leave. You have a wonderful evening. Take care. One nineteen. I'm going to have a positive ID on a suspect. It's going to be... Bernard Jiming is going to be a Caucasian male with blonde hair and he's going to be wearing a black suit and I'm going to be out looking for them over. And yeah, the last one, I didn't even have a chance to tell dispatch. He was literally right there. It's crazy. Not very often that that happens. Okay, let's check our map quickly, see where he could have gone right. He could have gone this way, or he could have also gone that way and went down that main street. We'll have a quick look here. If we can't see him here, we'll go back on ourselves. Although that, could that be him right there? Uh, that could be him. 119 standby, possible 20 on that suspect. Excuse me, sir. Excuse me. Can I have a word with you, please? Captain Martin, Brighton Police Department. Reason for the detainment is that you match the description of a wanted person. Okay, sir, any ID on you at all? Thank you, sir. Much appreciated. Okay, Bernard Xi Ming. And he has bruised hands. Okay, sir. He also has an open warrant. Okie dokie. Alright, sir. Firstly, you're going to be getting a citation for that expired ID. And at this time, you're going to be placed under arrest for aggravated assault and for having an open warrant in your name, okay? Please turn around and place your hands behind your back for me. 119, one in custody. Okay, sir. Anything on is going to poke me, hurt me, stick me, or otherwise. Okay, we have a switchblade, a yo-yo, local laundry bill, glasses, and a bag of white powder. All right, sir. Come with me, please. I'm going to place you in the back of my car. Okay, sir. Mind your head for me, please. One nineteen that aggravated assault call is going to be code four and you can show me one ten fifteen ten nineteen. Okay, what have we got here? 119, I'm going to be on the scene of an accident. Alright buddy, you stay there. Evening ma'am, Captain Martin, Brighton Police Department. Would you mind telling me what happened here, what you saw? 
All right, ma'am. Do you have any ID on you at all? License, registration, proof of insurance of the vehicle? Thank you very much, ma'am. Much appreciated. Okay, Carmelita Herrera. That is going to be expired. And that is going to be valid. 7 India Zulu Mike 82. Okay. Expired license plate as well. All right, ma'am. At this time, we're going to be getting two citations. First citation is going to be for an expired ID. And the second citation is going to be for that expired license plate, okay? All right, ma'am. Have you consumed any alcohol taken on any drugs I should be made aware of? Okay, ma'am, at this time, you're going to be placed under arrest for driving under the influence of cannabis, okay? Please turn around and place your hands behind your back for me. 119, one in custody. Alright, ma'am, anything on you is going to poke me, hurt me, stick me, or otherwise. Okay, switch played napkins and three quarters of an ounce of marijuana. All right, ma'am. Gonna move to the sidewalk here for your own safety. Okay, did this female see anything? No, she did not. Right, and I'm guessing these involved parties over here are part of this accident. All right, let's go and have a quick word with them. Evening, ma'am. Captain Martin, Brighton Police Department. Would you mind telling me what happened here, what you saw? Okay, ma'am. Thank you very much for that. Any ID on you at all? License, registration, proof of insurance of the vehicle? Thank you very much, ma'am. Much appreciated. Joanne Serrano, that is going to be expired. And she doesn't have any insurance either. 8 Romeo Mike 422. All right, ma'am. At this time, we're going to be getting two citations. The first citation is going to be for an expired ID. And the second citation is going to be for no valid insurance, okay? Alright ma'am, have you consumed any alcohol or taken any drugs that I should be made aware of? Okay, 0 0.103, so she is DUI alcohol and drunk as a skunk. She can barely stand on her own two feet. Okay, ma'am, at this time, you're going to be placed under arrest for driving under the influence of alcohol. Please turn around and place your hands behind your back for me. 119, one in custody. All right, ma'am. Anything on you is going to poke me, hurt me, stick me or otherwise? Okay, gum, a pocketbook and some napkins. Wonderful, ma'am. Gonna move to the sidewalk for your own safety. Cover me, please. Alright, ma'am, stay there for me. Alright, see if we have any other witnesses here. Nope, that gentleman didn't see anything. What about this female? Evening, ma'am. Yeah, up to Martin Brighton Police Department. Would you mind telling me what happened here, what you saw? Okay, ma'am. Thank you very much for that. Any ID on you at all? Thank you very much. Okay, you're the Kato. That is going to be valid. And that's going to be clear and valid.
Perfect. Ma'am, you are free to leave. You have a wonderful evening. Take care. Evening, ma'am. Captain Martin, Brighton Police Department. Would you mind telling me what happened here, what you saw? Okay, ma'am. Thank you very much for that. Any ID on you at all? Thank you very much. Okay, we have Eva Hayashi. That is going to be valid. Okay, that is also going to be clear and valid. Wonderful. Ma'am, you are going to be free to leave. You have a wonderful evening. Evening, sir. Captain Martin, Brighton Police Department. Would you mind telling me what happened here, what you saw? Okay, sir. Do you have any ID on you at all? License, registration, proof of insurance of the vehicle? Thank you very much, sir. Much appreciated. Sultan Hill, that is going to be valid. And that is also going to be valid. 9 Foxtrot Juliet 730. Okay, perfect. Sir, have you consumed any alcohol, taken any drugs that I should be made aware of? All right, sir, you just bear with me and I'll be back with you in a moment, okay? Evening, ma'am. Captain Martin, Brighton Police Department. Would you mind telling me what happened here, what you saw? Okay, ma'am. Thank you very much for that. Any ID on you at all? Okay, ma'am. Thank you very much. Carolina Cabrera. That is going to be valid. And that is also going to be clear and valid. Wonderful, ma'am. You are going to be free to leave. You have a wonderful evening. Evening, ma'am. Captain Martin, Brighton Police Department. Would you mind telling me what happened here, what you saw? Okay, ma'am. Thank you very much for that. Do you have any ID on you at all? Thank you very much, ma'am. Much appreciated. Okay, Chara Russia, that is going to be valid. And that is going to be a stolen ID. Okay, ma'am. At this time, you're going to be placed under arrest for possession of a stolen ID. Please turn around and place your hands behind your back for me. 119, one in custody. All right, ma'am, anything on is going to poke me, hurt me, stick me otherwise. Okay, cucumber, pocketbook, and some cigarettes. 119, can I get a 32 down to my current 20 for a 1015? Ten four, copy that. Thank you, dispatch. Okay. Evening, sir. Captain Martin, Brighton Police Department. Would you mind telling me what happened here? What you saw? Okay, sir. Thank you very much for that. Do you have any ID on you at all? License, registration, proof of insurance of the vehicle. Okay, thank you very much, sir. Ignacio Wojcik, that is going to be valid. And that is also going to be valid. 7 Tango Lima, 366. Okay, he has an expired license plate. Sir, at this time, you're going to be getting a citation for that expired license plate, okay? 
And have you consumed any alcohol, taken any drugs I should be made aware of? Alright, so you just bear with me. I'll be back with you in a moment, okay? Evening, ma'am. Captain Martin, Brighton Police Department. Would you mind telling me what happened here, what you saw? Alright, ma'am. Thank you very much for that. Any ID on you at all? License, registration, proof of insurance off the vehicle? Thank you very much. Much appreciated. Okay, Kai Zatsyev, that is going to be valid. And that is going to be valid, except she doesn't have any insurance. And the license plate is going to be 6 Oscar Delta 494. All right, ma'am. At this time, you're going to be getting a citation for no valid insurance. And have you consumed any alcohol or taken any drugs I should be made aware of? Alright ma'am, you just bear with me and I'll be back with you in a moment. Okay, right, check the last on this taxi cab over here, and that should be everything. There we are, perfect. Okay, firstly, we're going to get an ambulance down here for that victim, even though I'm pretty sure that wasn't here when we arrived. Ma'am, just bear with me, I'm going to have an ambulance en route for you, okay? 119, I need a 1052 down to my current 20, I have an inch pedestrian here. Okay, ma'am. Here is an accident report for you. You are most welcome. Thank you for your patience and cooperation. You are going to be free to leave. You have a great day. And there we are. Alright, sir. Thank you for your patience and cooperation. Here is an accident report for you. You are most welcome, and you're also going to be free to leave. You have a wonderful day. Alrighty, ma'am. Thank you for your patience and cooperation. Here is an accident report for you. You're most welcome. You are free to leave. You have a wonderful evening. Take care. One nineteen, connected ten fifty one down to my current twenty four A immobilized vehicle. Ten four, copy that, thank you, dispatch. Okay. Right, whilst we're waiting for that tow truck to get on scene, we will give the female that's been arrested her accident report. Ma'am, here's an accident report for you. 
You're most welcome. And 119, can I get a 32 down to my current 20 for a 10 15? Ten four, copy that, thank you, dispatch. One nineteen, can I get a ten fifty one down to my current twenty front of my blind vehicle? M four, copy that, thank you, dispatch. Alright, sir, can you wait there for me please? And same with you, ma'am. Can you wait there for me please? Thank you. Okay, right, tow truck is going to be on scene for that sedan. We are slowly getting there. And there we are. One nineteen, gonna get a ten fifty one down to my current twenty for an impounded vehicle. Ten four, copy that, thank you, dispatch. Okay, sir. Thank you for your patience and cooperation. Here is an accident report for you. And you are most welcome, sir. You're gonna be free to leave. You have a wonderful evening. Okay, we should actually be able to get one lane reopen now. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to allow this vehicle to move, ma'am. You're free to move. She should stay in her lane. Perfect. Okie dokie. Right. Sir, you're also going to be free to move. Where are you going? You're going that way? Okay. That'll do. Perfect. Traffic is freely flowing again. We are just going to stay here, just to make sure that any traffic doesn't run into the back of the vehicle. One nineteen, can I get a ten fifty one down to my current twenty for an immobilized vehicle? Ten four, copy that. Thank you, dispatch. Okay, things are getting along nicely. That's going to be all good. We have a tow truck on route. All right, let's go and sort this out. Okay, ma'am. Here is an accident report for you. You are most welcome. 119, can I get a 32 times from our current 20 for a 1015? Ten four, copy that. Thank you, dispatch. One nineteen, can I get a ten fifty one down to my current twenty for an impounded vehicle?
Ten four, copy that. Thank you, dispatch. And dispatch that accident scene is going to be code four. And you can show me one ten fifteen at ten nineteen. Are you kidding me? Seriously? Oh my lord. Okay, 119. You can show me on the scene of an accident. Right. I need to get this sealed off because cars are just piling up here. to place that down. Alright, why won't it let me place any barriers down? Oh, flip's sake. Right. See if we can grab some cones. Okay, looks like that's going to be it for cones. Oh, I don't know why you want to go that way. Right, let's just get this sorted out as quick as we can. Evening, ma'am. Captain Martin, Brighton Police Department. Would you mind telling me what happened here? What you saw? All right, ma'am. Do you have any ID on you at all? License, registration, proof of insurance off the vehicle. Thank you very much, ma'am. Much appreciated. Okay, Ahana Barrera. That is going to be valid. And that's also going to be valid. One Juliet Papa 219. Okay, Ahana Barrera. That is all clear and valid. Wonderful, ma'am. Have you consumed any alcohol, taken any drugs that I should be made aware of? All right, ma'am, just bear with me. I'll be back with you in a moment. Okay, evening, sir. Captain Martin, Brighton Police Department, would you mind telling me what happened here, what you saw? Okay, sir, not a problem. Any ID on you at all? License, registration, proof of insurance of the vehicle? Thank you, sir, much appreciated. Okay, Jerry Mimi Mercier, that is going to be valid. And no insurance and an expired license plate. Okay, sir, have you consumed any alcohol, taken any drugs that I should be made aware of? Alright sir, at this time you're going to be getting two citations. The first citation is going to be for no valid insurance. 
And a second citation is going to be for an expired license plate, okay? Alright, sir. I'll be back with you in a moment, okay? Evening, ma'am. Captain Martin, Brighton Police Department. Would you mind telling me what happened here, what you saw? All right, ma'am, not a problem. Do you have any idea on you at all? License, registration, proof of insurance off the vehicle? Thank you very much, ma'am. Much appreciated. Okay, Kathleen Nader, that is going to be valid. And that is also going to be valid. Eight kilo Charlie, three, four, one. And she has an open warrant out for arrest. All right, ma'am. Have you consumed any alcohol, taken any drugs I should be aware of? Okay, ma'am. At this time, you're going to be placed under arrest for having an open warrant in your name, okay? Please stand around and place your hands behind your back for me. 119, one in custody. Alright, ma'am. Anything on you is going to poke me, hurt me, stick me, or otherwise. Okay, City Guide Natkins and a Stellello, ma'am. I'm going to move to the sidewalk for your own safety. Evening, ma'am. Captain Martin, Brighton Police Department. Would you mind telling me what happened here, what you saw? All right, ma'am. Thank you very much for that. Do you have any ID on you at all? Thank you very much, ma'am. Much appreciated. Okay, Ulania Colon. That is going to be expired. And everything else is going to be clear and valid. Alright, ma'am. At this time, you're getting a citation for that expired ID. And you are going to be free to leave. You have a great evening. Okay, sir. Mind your head for me, please. So yeah, guys, I decided to cut that down a bit as it was uh, taking quite long and the episode had already gone on long enough. So I decided to just get that out of the way. And we would uh, jump forward a little bit and get this gentleman back to the precinct and put him in a cell. Okay, sir, step in here for me and I will take this cuffs off. Yeah, guys, I do hope you enjoyed the episode of Police Simulator Patrol Officers. Oh, it's going to be this desk over here. And until the next episode. Take care.